this is Nicolette. I wanted to answer a question about how to easily create an editable PDF. This is what I usually do for TCC. If the design is less than 30 pages, I'll create it inside of Canva and then I'll export it as a PDF. If it's longer, we'll create it in InDesign. Then we'll download this as a PDF and then I go to a program called PDF Escape and I upload my PDF right in there. And then to make those parts editable, lift top hand corner is where you'll add in wanting to do. So if you want to, you can even go link, highlight this and add a URL. And if you make a mistake, just go delete object like that. And then sometimes it just takes a while to load. So over here, you can see there's a line. Now what I do is I go to form field and there's text, here's a different option. So there's text, text paragraph, check box, radio, drop down, list box, all these. So you'll go text, select, and you'll just make a little text box like that. And then for something like this, which is a paragraph, you'll go form field, text paragraph, select, and then select that whole box. Um, we usually try and keep those boxes, these boxes, quite consistent in the size and the layout. And so you want to do the same for this as well. So you can duplicate that um, to get it exactly the same. And then these would be the text again. And then I'll show you really quick how to make a checklist as well. So if you had a checklist, let's say these were all checklists here. You'd go to form field, check box, select and you would make your, checks box, your check box. It's very important that you do it this way and not use this check mark feature over here. And if you forgot to add certain things like your own check box, you can use these tools over here and create one. And then up here, you can change the color as well. And then you'll use this guy to put it inside. And then once you're done, what you want to do is hit save. So it's this old school stuffy here. And then hit the download button right below it. So I hope that this is helpful for anybody who was wondering how we create those and make those editable PDFs. If you have any questions, let me know and I'd be happy to get back to you as soon as I can. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.